Hi, my name is Zainab and I'm one of the Outreach Ambassadors here at Newcastle University. And today I'm going to talk to you about some of the ways in which you can find resources to help you write an academic essay. Now, a good research strategy is key to success. So it's important to think about which resources are available to you. You also need to consider where and how you might find them before you begin your search. So when doing your, your research, it's useful to begin by listing as many resources as you can think of that may be relevant to your topic. So for example, here we've got some websites, comics, documentaries, journal articles, newspapers, anything that you can think of that may be relevant to your topic, put it down in a list. Keep an open mind and don't rule anything out. You can narrow your search down at a later point. So moving on to narrowing your search, you need to ensure to use a variety of different resources. It's also important to consider how reliable, trustworthy and relevant these resources are. Remember, every person's topic is different, so their list of resources will look different to yours. top tip is a good academic essay will use a variety of different resources as hopefully this will help your work stand out in the crowd. So the internet is a great place to find resources however you need to know how to search for reliable trustworthy and relevant resources again the, there goes those three words they're very important. Just typing your whole question into a search engine such as Google is unlikely to produce the best results. So you need to identify the keywords in your essay and search for these. Remember to use and, or, and not to narrow your search down. Use quotation marks around words to search for particular phrases. In this question that we have here, you can see that we've highlighted the keywords. So maybe you'd want to search environmental and genetic and appetite to hopefully give you the right results. Check out our sixth form study skills website for more details on narrowing your search and this link can be found at the end of this um, video. So have you thought about making your search easier by maybe using the internet in different ways? So you might want to use Google Scholar instead of Google, which will search academic sources only rather than everything on the internet. So hopefully these resources might be more reliable. Um, and we've got a screenshot here and I'll just zoom in so you can check that out. Maybe you can use different search engines such as Sweet Search, which uses different algorithms to Google. So hopefully this will provide different results. Or you can have a look at the further reading related articles which many search engines and websites such as google scholar and wikipedia include so click on the links to these further reading and related articles and then a top tip that we've got here is don't just use the top result the best resource may be at the bottom of the page or even on page four so click through and have some patience when doing your research So of course the internet is a fantastic place to start, um, but maybe you might want to think about other resources that you can use. So these might include books, interviews, newspapers, documentaries, anything that's relevant to your topic. Use a book index to find out which sections you need to read. You may not need to read the entire book, so hopefully this will save you some time when you're doing your research. Now, Moving on to time, give yourself plenty of time to do your research. It will probably take longer than you think, but it is essential to writing a sound academic essay. Remember, you need to make sure the resources that you use are reliable, relevant and trustworthy. So have some patience. And then a top tip is to save yourself lots of time, record your references as you do your research. So maybe open up a Word document and write down where you got the write down the reference website link and where it's um, included in your essay. So hopefully this will save you more time. And watch our video on plagiarism and referencing for more information. 
with that i just want to say thank you for listening and watching this video we hope you found it helpful more information can be found on our sixth form study skills website as is shown in this screenshot here and the link can be found just there we hope it was a helpful video and again thank you for listening